This segment sponsored by Mosquito Joe of Baltimore. Well, I know I'm already tired of all the bugs that will be coming out, and we haven't even gotten to the real heat yet. Well, good news. Kurt and Melissa Godwin with Mo Mosquito Joe of Baltimore are here to tell us how to easily get rid of them for good. Yes, for good, right? Yes, for yes. good. Oh, my gosh. Okay, welcome. They're my new besties. Okay. <laughs> thank so, you for having us. No, thank you for being here. So why is mosquito control important, aside from the fact that they're pesky? Well, it's important for a couple different reasons. One of the main reasons is people spend a lot of money on their yards, and they right. want to enjoy it. And without with mosquitoes, you can't. But the number one reason is mosquitoes carry a lot of bad diseases. <laughs> um, mosquitoes kill more people in one day than sharks kill in 100 years, per the Gates Foundation. What? So they carry Zika and West Nile virus and really bad stuff. So it's important to control them to protect our health, most importantly. Well, how soon should we start with that? Is okay, it too so, late? No, absolutely not at all. So at Mosquito Joe, our job is to make outside fun again. Okay. So you and your family can enjoy the outdoors without the pesky mosquitoes and other annoying bugs. But the season is actually April through the end of October. Oh. Uh, it's never too late, though. We are running right now into the height of the season, so now is a perfect time. Okay, so how does it actually work? Well, our guys are going to come, they dress like Ghostbusters, and the first thing they do is look for all the water in your property. Mm -hmm. And we're going to get rid of all the water because mosquitoes breed in water, mm -hmm. so you got to get rid of it. And then what they're going to do is they're going to spray a product on the bushes, trees, and foliage, eliminates mosquitoes on contact, and then for the next three weeks, it has a residual that any one of those animals or the bugs that we treat, which is mosquitoes, fleas, ticks, and stink bugs, if they land on one of those surfaces, they will also be eliminated. Um, so it works really well. We come back on a repetitive cycle in the summer, April through October, to keep your yard uh, protected protected and secure. Okay, wow. So say all the other bugs too, because they all drive me crazy, but you said stink bugs too. That's like a big yes. problem. Mosquitoes, yes. fleas, ticks, and stink bugs are our primary targets. Yes. Okay. So ticks too. Yep. Okay, so that's good to know, especially with all the Lyme disease concern Correct. here. Right. Okay, so will the kids and the pets be safe? Absolutely. The um, product that we use is very low in toxicity, okay. and it's only targeting the insects we um, target, which are your mosquitoes, fleas, ticks, and stink bugs. Plus, uh, pet owners love us because we get those fleas and ticks. Right. So all is good. Okay, yeah. and ticks are definitely a major issue here, right? Ticks are yeah. a huge issue. I mean, we are just south of Tick Central, which is southern Pennsylvania, and actually my son had Lyme disease twice when he was a child, and it was no fun. So what we figure, too, is if we can prevent one kid from getting Lyme disease, it's worthwhile what we're doing. Right, and we have the tips going on the screen, right? So what are some of the tips? The number one tip for ticks is to keep your yard cut short. Ticks like to be in tall grass and they want to sit there where they can jump onto you. They don't like a suntan, so keep the grass cut short. Yeah. Um, keep all the yard uh, debris piles clear, piles of leaves, piles of sticks and woods like that, they'll hang out there. Get rid of that. And then it's very similar to mosquito control, you got to get rid of the standing water. So if you can get rid of the standing water, keep your yard cut short, your grass cut short, put your swing set in the middle of the yard, not on the side of the yard, um, things like that. That will help prevent ticks in your property. Okay, and so what, what's another place that ticks even come from if you're not near like a really big wooded area? Well, I mean, they're living everywhere. You know, we, we saw an interesting statistic in a training I went to recently. Ticks can live for 542 days without eating. What? So, which is just That's a crazy. bizarre statistic. But they really come from everywhere and they're crawling and they're jumping. They don't fly, but they jump and they're just moving to where they can find food and food is you. So you want to keep them away. Okay. Right. And so you guys, I mean, you had an honor to talk about too, right? You were named the 2018 Anne Arundel County Chamber of Commerce. There you Small go. Business. business of the year. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so, so tell me about that honor. I mean, so that means on top of helping us, we know that, you know, you're... Mm -hmm. A plus rated, right? Yeah, it was really it was a great honor that we, we do a lot of participation with the uh, Chamber of Commerce and help mentor new members um, and be a part of our community. We try to give back to our community with various charitable events, and I think the the chamber recognized that in awarding us that you know as our small business group. So uh, it was very we were very humbled by that, and it was very nice. Yeah. It feels good to help families help their families enjoy right. the outdoors. Right, and I actually last summer had an issue where my son, a toddler came up with an unspecified bite and was actually treated for Lyme disease. So yes, as long as you can catch it, that's the most important thing. Right, so I get how scary um, that can be. So yeah. what kind of feedback do you get from families? 
They're, they're excited to see us. Uh, right. We have families telling us that they haven't been able to enjoy their outdoors mm -hmm. for many years, and now they don't have to worry about the kids. Not only do they have to spray them with bug spray anymore, right. they can leave them outdoors and, and feel comfortable and safe. We had a guy write us last year and he said, thanks to Mosquito Joe, my wife stepped foot in our yard for the first time in 25 years. Okay. And well, we know we can help that, and it feels really good to be able to do that. I love it. Well, congratulations. And where can people find more information about you guys? Right, so you can find us at baltimore.mosquitojoe.com. Okay. Well, cool. I'm coming to you again. Thank you so All right. much. Thank, Thank you, you for having us. Being here. All right. Well, before you hit the outdoors this Sunday for Monday,